Hello, my name is Michael Sinney, and I'm excited to show you our latest feature in Toggle, our new image search. At Toggle, we are giving image search a whole new upgrade. Within Toggle, our users are able to utilize our AI technology to search your plans for any custom symbol or image you would like to count on each plan. With our AI technology, we are able to ignore the background noise that we see on many drawings today and have a more accurate and defined count up front for the users. Today I'm going to show you how we can access the image search tool and a few examples of how we can utilize this tool for your, your takeoffs today. So once you're here on the canvas within Toggle, you're going to want to come over here and click on the magnifying glass over here on the left hand side of your screen. Also that says search. Once you click on the search button, you should automatically open up to text, but if you come over here on the right hand side, you'll see that image is now available for you to utilize in Toggle. Once you click on that, you can go ahead and look around in your drawings and find a object or image you would like to search on your plan. And basically we're going to be drawing a bounding box around this symbol. So for example, on this plan, I would like to count my outlet symbol. So I left click and drag while holding to draw an outline around the object itself. And then you'll see this uh, preview appear and I click search. And that is letting you know the AI is doing its magic and searching the plans for you for every single instance where this image occurs. As you see, once it finishes the count, we can click here on these uh, arrow symbols to scroll through to confirm if each uh, outlet is correct. And once we finish reviewing this process, we can click over here to choose a classification and we can create a new classification based off of this image. So I can call this my duplex outlets. I can pick a color, a symbol, and then go ahead and click save. Now I'll click convert, and you see that will convert to account, and now I have 79 outlets available. We can also utilize this to find uh, lighting fixtures on a plan. So again, I'm gonna scroll into my plan, find the fixture I wanna locate, come over to the search icon on the bottom left-hand side, select image, draw a bounding box around that fixture, click search, and the AI again worked perfectly. And you see, it ignores any background noise that can occur on the plans to accurately find the exact symbol you're looking. Even distinguishing the difference between these emergency fixtures and non-emergency fixtures for you. Choose a classification, create a classification, and call it lighting fixture type A. We can also use the image search on our elevation plans to count objects that we see on the elevation of a building. For example, I want to go ahead and count these sliding glass doors. So again, I'm going to come over here and click on the search symbol, go over to image, and draw a bounding box around that sliding glass door. Click search, and let the AI do the work for you. In addition to being able to create a new classification, we can also use an existing classification and add that to our count. So you see again here, the AI finished its count process. And to use an existing classification I previously created, I would, do, I would come down to choose classification and go down to ungrouped. As you see, I already had sliding glass doors created. So I can use this count symbol to go ahead and convert it and count it to my glass symbol or my sliding glass door count. As you see, the AI was able to pick up 61 sliding glass doors instantly for us. I hope you enjoyed this video. Here at Togo, we are continuing to pave the way for innovation and advancing the pre-construction industry. Thank you.